Hi, I'm Jamie LaPrice. I'm the Vice President of UCSA Fast Pitch uh, and I oversee our USA Elite Select program. We're out here. We've been here this weekend for the Select 30 All-American Games. It's year two. We're out in Baton Rouge uh, just watching and evaluating some of the top kids in the country. And today is the big day where we've narrowed it down to the top 30 and we're out here for the All-American Games. So this whole idea came together of we want to get some of the best kids in the country from each grad class on one field at the same time where they're competing. It's a neutral evaluation. Nobody knows what teams they come from, but they get out here, they compete on one field, and we wanted to put it around the NPF championship as well. So the, these kids are those next generation of pro softball players. So they get out here, two days of getting after it, training, they're being evaluated, uh, and after two days we name our top 30 for each class. I think it's very important just for spreading the sport of softball, and I think it's really cool that the NPF is here too, um, just to really influence all of us to hopefully when we grow up, do that. You know, you work some of these tournaments or these showcases and you'll have your top tier athletes and you have your bottom. At the Select 30, there isn't that separation. I mean, everybody's in that top category. There's no huge separation. It's just a lot of competition and great talent across the board. It was very hands-on, so we had a bunch of coaches helping us and helping us with our game. But I think the biggest thing that stood out was it's just the level of competition that's here. You know, you don't see it a lot in different tournaments where you go, but it's top notch here. Being involved in a camp like this is huge, not only because of the base of coaches that are involved and like, you know, we have girls out here that are already committed, so you'd think at that point in your life, you're like, ah, I'm not gonna do a camp, but these girls now are playing against the best competition. So we have girls out here from Auburn, Ole Miss, LSU recruits, so it's like, now it's like you're starting to see the level of play that you're going to see for the next four years. So it's just all about preparing you for the next level. Um, I think it's very important as far as exposure, especially if they wanna play on the next level. And I think they can come here and learn a lot from the college players and the college coaches so they know what to expect. You know, today we're out here for the final for the Select 30 games. And I think the goal is really just to, to show what our talent is across this country and how even at young, our 2023 class, and how great those kids are, their game knowledge, you know, how well they play the game. And I, I think it's about taking our game to the next level, exposing these kids to next level opportunities. Uh, and that's what the Select 30 is all about. It's about development. It's about exposure. It's about competition. And I think it's fun to watch these young ladies get out here and compete and to how they handle themselves as an individual of coming out here to a team. So I love the Select 30 process. Uh, I think we have big plans going forward and we'll continue to grow this program. And that's what it's all about, is how do we continue to give back to the game and, and how do we give these athletes opportunities to grow and to grow our sport.